Hello everyone, it's Vicky Chapari on what's going on in our community. Uh, today we are with Diego Cortez, he's the owner with Lead Media. Hello Diego, how are you today? I'm doing well, thank you. How thank are you? you for having us. Thank you. Uh, Diego is the owner again for Lead Media and he's a company who manages all the social media and website and I'm one of the lucky clients with Diego and he's really helping in my business. So Diego, could you let the community know about your business and yeah, how did you start the business? Uh, so Lean Media began in January 2016. At first, uh, I started with you. Uh, I remember we uh, remember I wanted to kind of show you how to leverage social media. Mm -hmm. And uh, from there, we had a few sessions, and I started realizing that um, you and many other real estate agents are very busy people. You have a lot of work to do. You have to meet clients, and uh, um, I thought about how that, um, the fact that you're so busy um, and you didn't have too much time to, le to leverage social media, I thought about offering the service mm -hmm. myself. So that's where the idea came to be. Um, and I, had, I have a background in, in marketing and, and I thought about, well, how about looking at social media from a business perspective? And social media has been around for a long time. And at that time, I just wanted to explore an opportunity to uh, set up a business, running social media and managing it. And it developed into uh, what it is now, which is uh, a, a company that manages not only the day-to-day -day aspect, but focuses on things like the advertising mm -hmm. on social media and uh, things like engaging with the community and, and understanding a brand, um, you as an example, understanding uh, who you want to speak to, uh, understanding who your target audience mm -hmm. would be, and putting content that's that it's relatable and uh, engaging. Things like events, mm -hmm. uh, things like or things like going on in the community. Now, let's just in this case, um, for as an example for you, for you um, but with other clients, it all depends on their business exactly. and, and their yeah. objectives. Um, but uh, overall, social media is a place to to engage. And to be there. <laughs> exactly, to be there. Yeah. And um, what is your client? Because in my experience for me, um, when I started working with you and your company, it was a peace of mind. Because as you say before, I mean, we are busy and we have to focus really on what we know. Yeah. And let the company and like you working on social media because it's time consuming and it's so many things like advertising, like putting the content and everything that you have to spend a lot of time with that. So for me, it was like a piece of mind, and uh, I have more time for me to focus really right. in my job. Uh, what your client find when they start working with you? I mean, this is, was my experience, but I just yeah. would like to know in general. Yeah, for sure, it's a good question. So the clients, there's two types of clients that, that, I, uh, that we have. We have the client like yourself, where uh, you have other things to do in, in your day-to-day -day business, in that social media, although you know it's important, mm -hmm you rather have someone that understands the marketing goals that you have and you, you want to allocate um, that, uh, that marketing um, initiative to a company like myself. So we handle the day-to-day -day aspect and other things like the advertising and, and visual development. Um, now that's one segment of mm -hmm. clients that we have. The other segment is uh, what we call the do-it-yourself client. The do-it-yourself client is more or less the individual that uh, wants to take um, the driving the, the, the driving seat on, on social media. So they just need the right tools, they need the right marketing strategy, and they need to understand how to build a community around what they offer, whether it may be a product or whether it may be a service. Mm -hmm. So what we do is really offer consultancy. Okay, and if they right. want us to then take over, because they've realized that, you know, it takes a lot of time. Then from there, we, we work with them uh, on a day to day. So those are the two two Different type of clients right. that come to us. Yeah. Okay. And um, for people who just start in the company, I mean, if uh, anyone is interested in, like, you know, being social media, uh, what is your uh, advice? You know, I mean, yeah. uh, how you can help them? I mean, it's just I know that it's a website. And you manage what is a uh, Facebook, Pinterest. I mean, it's so many yeah. things that you have different packages for. Yeah, so we have different packages. It really depends on the business. Some businesses can be on Facebook and Instagram. Some businesses should just be on LinkedIn. Mm -hmm. um, it really depends. Uh, so my best advice would really be to understand what marketing is and why 
marketing and branding more importantly because marketing I think marketing is more short term branding is more yeah. long term because you want to establish a presence and that takes takes time to craft around it so and it, and it takes um, experience and understanding what and why marketing works and what and why branding mm -hmm. is important to push your marketing. Yeah. So my best advice for, for small business, I'm a small business owner, so really is educating yourself on marketing or reaching out to someone that um, you know has an understanding on marketing and branding and ask them questions, ask them questions, ask them to, to find out find out what, what are some tools to use, uh, especially small business owners. They, 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 you need to be smart with, with your money. So I think you know every small business owner should try to, to run their own mm -hmm. social media uh, marketing strategy and learn. And if they realize that they can, then they should really consider allocating that budget to someone that understands the, 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 the yeah. platform and, and the different platforms out there. Um, but best advice would be to learn what and why about marketing and branding. So important, yeah. And the last question and for me was really important when we start working together. Uh, when you start working with your client, and as I said before, for me it's important that you understand your client. Yeah. I mean, uh, every client is different and you have different approach with your client. Yeah. yeah, so for me it was really nice and important that you know how I talk with my people. Yeah. So that is something that you really focus on your company too, yeah. right? Yeah, definitely. I think, I think one of the things that we do at first um, is get to know the owner, mm -hmm. uh, get to know the, the, what what their objective is, um, and, and and talk to them about um, who 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 they um, understand their client to be mm -hmm. their one essential fan, and then from there we build off of that. We try to speak to that exactly. person through yeah. uh, images, through videos, through um, writing. Um, so it, it, that's that's probably the most important part exactly. is understanding yeah. the client first, mm -hmm. and then and then understanding why the client runs the business that they run, and then from there using using um, or leveraging marketing and branding yeah. to to execute on, on what we do. Yeah, that's yeah. great. So thank you so thank much, you. Diego. Uh, could you give us your phone number so if the people want to reach you? Um, yeah, definitely. Uh, anyone that wants to reach me can reach me at uh, my phone number is six four seven nine zero seven nine seven seven eight. Um, Anyone interested in looking at what we have going on, they can go on our Facebook page. It's um, lean, so it's facebook.com forward slash lean media studio. And on Instagram, we are under lean media studio. And you can check out our gallery, you can check out the information that we post out there. We post a lot of free information mm -hmm. about marketing, about branding, and uh, we also have, we're starting a, a vlog on YouTube. Um, but uh, on our on our on our Facebook um, page, you can see the uh, videos that we have uh, we're preparing. Um, and yeah, that's that's the best way to get in touch. Okay, that's right. Thank you so Not much again. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Hope to see you soon. Thank bye. you. Bye bye.